French Jim Nance along with Bill Sims and we're about to go live with our game matchup. It's an important game in some respects. No the playoffs aren't going to happen in this case but there's always that storyline about trying to build for next year and a little respect. How do you see it Bill? I think you always go into it with this mindset if you're the coach and you kind of translate this to the players. It's a must win game and then if it doesn't turn out on your side then you paint a different scenario for them after the game. But if you go with that attitude, must win, I think it helps you give a better effort and emotionally be ready to play. That's what you have. Jones is set now as we prepare to kick it away. And he's tackled right at the 30-yard line after that return. Newton's going to jog out to the huddle now. Trying to have a turnover free game today. Out of the shotgun formation. Looks to his left. Has Olsen. Keeps his legs moving. What's the old expression? Just move the chains. That's what they did with that throw and catch that time, Tim. It also gives them a chance for three more downs. The Panthers will take the snap from the 45. Olsen's got it pass that had some heat. Jim picking up a couple first downs early in the game. It's well it's like when you play golf and you par the first couple holes. I know it doesn't happen a lot, but when you do, it makes you feel good. The defense gets the sack. There is nothing worse for a quarterback than have the pocket collapse. And that time it collapsed on his left side. There's nothing he can do and he goes down for the sack. On the money. Gets about four yards that time. So they get the reception, but it's not enough to move the chains. Third down coming up. The Eagles go with the dime formation here on defense. Breaks the tackle. This play will hold up. He's inbound. Newton selling this play big time. The defense, they go for the run fake, and that's why he has time to throw the football and makes the completion. Good job. Newton's going to keep it. Almost intercepted that time. Failing to complete that one, so second down here. Offense lines up here. They'll go shotgun here. They're going to get him here for a sack. That time the quarterback didn't hold the football. The left side of the line just, they just collapse. He doesn't even feel it or see it, and he goes down for the sack. Underneath, but can't find the mark that time as the pass goes incomplete. Defensive coordinators love this situation, don't they? Third and long, they can do just about anything, and it's going to work, and they stop the offense that time. The field goal try, yes, sir. There's nothing like being ahead in the football game, no matter how many points it is, because now you can manage it in a different way, even though it's early in this game, and you make the other team come after you. That's a touchback, and the ball will be spotted at the 20. First down here. The Panthers defense brings in an extra member of the secondary. They'll go nickel. Here's the give to LaShawn McCoy. And he gains maybe three. And here we have second down. McCoy lines up in the backfield. They'll go ground, trying to fight through right up the middle of the field. Good piece of tackling. Eagles now facing third down. A week ago, they were up to the challenge in these spots. The Eagles this time will go with two tight ends. The Eagles will take the snap from the 30. Takes it again. Games 11. The Eagles offensive line is just whooping some tail today. Aren't they? What a job up front. That helps the running back get in space, get down there, and pick up a big game. The Eagles have turned into the cardiac kids. They Let's won go. a tight one last oh, yeah. week, but they trail in this one with time remaining. You've got to be cool under pressure, and I think this is a pressure situation. you got to make plays when it counts in situations just like this. 
Nickel formation here for the defense. Second down and five. McCoy. Now they take the football onto the opponent's side of the field. The ever elusive LaShawn McCoy breaking the big one. Jim Lott, LaShawn McCoy is one of the best running backs in the league, and Chip Let's Kelly's go. offense fits him perfectly. He takes advantage of it so fast, and he makes more people miss him than any running back in the NFL. They went with the ground game on first down, bringing up second. And Matthews is in the slot. Matt Barkley now will take it from the shotgun. The defense gets a sack. Jim, you can't tell the difference between the quarterback and the center. They're both retreating about as fast as you can go. That time the center gets run over, and it leads to a sack of the QB. Let's go. Third and eight. Under fire all day. The punter awaits the snap. They're set to punt it away now. are ready to take over now and their offense heads on to the field coming to the line hoping to avoid being sacked for a third time and Williams is in on the tackle Williams is the guy anytime he gets a chance to get in the secondary and make a big play he thinks he's going to take it for a touchdown not this time it's a big run but still well done he'll fire it out to the left a near interception that time by Boykin the defense did everything right that situation. They were in the right spot. They were smart. They read the quarterback's eyes, but they dropped the pass. Second down and 10. Gets it out for the completion. That's a gain of eight. The Panthers do a good job that time on second down. They don't force the football down the field. They throw it short. They pick up some solid yards to make it a good situation for them. Third and short. And it's going to be tackled, and that's going to bring us to fourth down. I think as time has gone on, more and more coaches and teams, we see them going for it on fourth and short. But this decision, you're, you're winning the game fourth and short. You're near midfield. I don't think you go for it. Don't let the pressure of the fans or your players Get into your mind. Put the football away. That's the right decision. LaShawn McCoy is in the backfield. Barkley standing back in the shotgun ready for the snap. And he's thrown to the ground. There's nothing worse to a quarterback than having an offensive lineman getting driven back in his way. That time the right side of the line collapses and it leads to a sack of the QB. Barkley's going to take the snap from the shotgun. Sticks to his hands. Well, it doesn't get much worse than this, does it? You're losing the football game. Now you're looking at third and long. And look, there are no miracles in the NFL. I'll tell you that. So be smart. If the play is not there, don't force it. Dump it off and wait for the next time you get it. Looking long. Intercepted. And he races out of bounds at that point. That was an awesome job by the defense. They just read the quarterback's eyes. They got in position, and they made the interception. The Panthers go with two tight ends on this play. This run goes nowhere. Stuck for a loss of four. Good job by the defense. They stopped the first down play that time by the offense, and now they have a good situation. Three-step drop. Throw to the left. A near interception. Boykin. Well, if you're the offensive coordinator here in a third long situation and you're winning the close game, you'd like to pick this up, but also you got to make sure you call a play that doesn't put the offense at too much risk. Tough call coming up here for the coordinator. He has the grab brought down at the 32. You just can't sit back there and play conservative defense in the NFL. The quarterbacks and receivers are too good. Third and over 10 yards, you play safe and you give up the first down. And Lyons is in on the tackle. If you're an offensive lineman and you can line up and just run the football straight ahead and pick up those kind of yards, you are going to get into the head of the defense. You're basically saying we're tougher than you are and we're just going to come right at you. Colton's a very smart runner. He knows situations in the game. 
He saw the first down yard markers, and what does he do? He gets past them and picks up the first down. Gains about three. Always a good idea to try to run the football when you get down the red zone because passing the football can be hard at times when you get close to the end zone, but the defense was ready, and they step up and make the stop for a little game. Williams is lined up behind his quarterback as the single back. A near interception that time by Boykin. Well, Jim, I threw a lot of passes like that in my career where it should have been intercepted, and the guy dropped it, and you just go, yes, I got a break. Now can you capitalize on the break? Third and seven. Olsen's brought down but has the first. We're early in this game, but this defense must figure out a way to cover up this tight end because he's putting up big numbers. I don't know if they can stop him, Jim. It's so hard for defenses now to come up with ways to stop these tight ends. They look like power forwards of the NBA. They're big, they're strong, they're fast. What do you do? If I'm on the defense and the offense is this close to scoring, I'll tell you what I'm doing. I am sending everybody. I am going to gamble that takes it across. It is a touchdown. touchdown. When you got a lead and you march down the field and you add on to that lead with a touchdown, it's fun to watch the other team. Will they stay patient or will they panic? My bet is they'll panic. the Panthers for the extra point. Extra point was good. 